Hey guys, business is expanding. Uh, we're kind of, well, I know you all know, at least if you follow us, you know that we got rid of a lot of the ducks. We still are getting a lot of eggs when they are all producing, so it is still part of our business, the duck eggs, but not quite as much of our sole focus as it was before. Um, the quail are gone, we sold all them, so we don't have the quail eggs anymore. Um, and one of the things we are expanding into is actually art. And finally, we're opening up an art studio here and uh, we're actually in it right now. Um, it's a work in progress. Uh, there is, well, you can see behind me. That's really hard to do in reverse. These paintings, there's just like a few, a little bit of a selection of some paintings to do for paint classes. Um, but most of them have been people have chosen their own themes, so some of those I don't have hanging up, but in any case, uh, over here that you can't see is our kitchen area that's completely not finished yet. There's a bunch of storage over there and things like that. So we're in the process of setting things up. Um, it's a little echoey down here because there's really not a lot on the walls yet. So yeah, we've got plans. But in the meantime, um, like I said, I figured I'd put some more art on our channel because it is part of our business now. Um, and one of the things I am doing right now is working on a series of paintings that, and I'll put, maybe right now, I'll put some pictures up of what I've done already. So I've been doing a few of them. This is the biggest one though. So far I've just been working on 16 by 20 canvases, all those ones you saw. This big guy. It is 30 by 40 inches. So we, well not we, I <laughs> am going to be painting a bear today on this canvas. So I figured I'd just record it and maybe you guys might be interested in seeing how, how I do it. So here we go. A bear. back and look at this thing. Yeah, okay. I'm pretty happy with the outline. Um, the only problem I'm having now is my paint marker is running out of paint so I have to go refill it. So I'm gonna go upstairs and do that because my paint supplies are still upstairs right now. And yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, I refilled my paint marker. I don't know if you can tell. My hands are covered in paint now. It's not as easy as the instructions would lead you to believe, but anyway. Um, taking a break from paintings is always a really good idea because when you come back, you see stuff that you didn't see before. Um, I'm really not happy with his mouth, so I'm gonna try to, like, I don't know, do something with it. Um, his eyes are a little off. There's just some, some things I'm going to try to correct here. Uh, I wanted to have friendlier eyes anyway, so um, yeah, that's something I gotta fix. And yeah, so hopefully this thing works. I haven't tested it yet, but we'll see. Let's go.
All right, so apparently the camera died and I have no idea when that happened, but here we are so far. I'm just gonna add some shading under him and I'm gonna go back with the paint marker and just crisp up some of these lines and that'll be it for this painting. Oh, and then I gotta seal it too, but that doesn't change the look of it at all. It's just a clear coat. So yeah, we're almost done here. Comment, like, and subscribe.